Hi, thanks for coming back. It's Matt here again with MyWebRoad.com, and today I want to just dive right in and show you that there is more than one place for customers to find you on the internet besides Google. Well, I'm always talking about Google though, and I'm a huge proponent of the Google network um, in regards to generating revenue for your business. Um, you make a decent sized investment on that platform and you should get a great return. But there is other ways to find your business and other very important ways and I'm going to show you that now. Um, right here is a statistic. This is mobile search engine market share in the United States of America. So mobile search engine market share is the one we always talk about. 94% of people are searching through Google. Um, very recently, in fact, if you look in September of 2008, that number was 89% because that was the number we told everyone, about 90% of people search on Google. Um, that number has increased rapidly because Apple just recently said that all Siri searches are going to happen through the Google search platform. So that's kind of cool. Good job for um, Google for grabbing that humongous client and agreement with Apple. I guess good job. I'm not really sure how I feel about all that. But anyway, so let's look now at this is the most important statistic I'm going to show you today, this month maybe. Maybe this is the most important statistic I'm ever going to show you in your life. In North America, mobile operating system market share has Apple iOS at 50%. 50% market share on an operating systems in North America because because I guess 50% of North Americans have an iPhone, which that shocks me, but I guess it's true. So another 50% on Android and then about 0.1% on this Samsung operating system. Oh, I feel bad for those people. So um, let's look at the next statistic. Another interesting one is that mobile browser market share in the United States of America. So mobile browser is not the operating system, but the browser. So on your phone, you're doing a search, you're clicking on the Chrome, you're clicking on the Safari. And most, since half of, since half of people are on an iPhone, and I guess 52% of them conduct their searches in the Safari browser, what that means is that more iPhone users have the have Safari and Chrome than Android users have Chrome. That's why that statistic makes sense. If you have an Android, you cannot have Safari. If you have a Apple iPhone, you can have Chrome. So this is how that works. And it's very interesting. 52% of these searches are going through Chrome. So let's move on and let me let me do this demonstration for you real quick. I'm in I'm in I live where I live. I'm me doing a search as me and I search brewery and when I search a brewery we get this map pack. On a mobile device, this map pack is the first thing you're going to see and you're going to usually you're going to be clicking more places and you're looking at the map on your phone. I'm not doing it on my phone because I just don't feel like doing it on my phone, but it's the same exact search right here is Primal, 11 Lakes, Ask Clown, D9. Cool. So that search right there is the one that companies are very comfortable spending lots of money on. And I don't blame them because we just we just said most searches are going through Google. So that's the that's the logic there. Let's, if we do that same search with Bing, watch what happens. Very quickly, let me show you. We also understand that these reviews are through the Google Review, Google My Business Review platform, not through this. Is ooh. So anyway, local results for brewery. You get all these tiles here. On your mobile device, you're also going to get tiles, but then you're going to also get this map right here, and we'll call this like the Microsoft Mac pa Map Pack. I'm not sure that that's the right terminology, but it's fine for me. So these businesses have optimized their business listing on the Microsoft platform and they have great Yelp reviews. And I personally am not a huge fan of Yelp, but if you own this kind of business, I guess it's just a fact of life, isn't it? Do that same search in Yahoo. In Yahoo, we do that same search and we get some organic results. Good job, Birdsong. That's awesome right there. Um, but then right here is we're talking about the map pack. So even Yahoo has its own map pack. So you guys, if you own a business and it's brick and mortar and you want to try and get people there and you're only utilizing the Google network, then it is time to wake up and it's time to start investing some of your time and some of your money on either professionals that understand this technology or you need to get this taken care of yourself, which I don't recommend at all. Um, I don't recommend in this at this level you take care of very many things yourself anymore. So um, let's do the same thing now on my iPhone. So I go to my iPhone, let me get in here, do, 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 do. now watch. I'm looking at my apps, I don't know, I don't know how well that's, how easy that's going to be to see, but I'm looking at my uh, apps, 
I click on maps, I go and I type in brewery. Okay, I had already conducted that search, so brewery is right there. So there, I'm looking at breweries. And so these breweries have an Apple business listing, okay? And that can be found here, and I'll, I'll show you right now. Mapsconnect.apple.com, and you're gonna get in there and create an account. You're gonna optimize and you're gonna maintain that account, and then you're gonna try and find ranking in the map pack, okay? So that's how important this stuff is, I think. I mean, if I run a business, I run an ice cream shop, people aren't searching on my computer in Google for ice cream shops near me like they used to. This stuff, we have to be smarter now and we have to understand how they're doing that search. And 50% of people, it says, are on an iPhone conducting that search and in a map looking at a listing that might not even exist. So that's the whole point of this. Uh, thank you guys so much for coming back. Um, as I host this YouTube channel, I'm mattatmywebbro.com. That's how you can email me, mattatmywebbro.com. I run an internet marketing agency where we do WordPress development and Shopify e-commerce development, as well as um, Google, Microsoft, and Apple integrations for national level companies. That's at daswow.com, mattatdaswow.com, or you can visit daswow.com. I'd also like to quickly talk about trafficisourjam.com. Because trafficisourjam.com is an e-commerce platform where business owners can go ahead and purchase turnkey internet marketing solutions. A internet marketing concierge, an onboarding specialist, will call you and get just enough information to go ahead and, and, and streamline that whole turnkey product, product for you all the way through to reporting so that you can just pay one bill every month and have um, certain scopes of work completely maintained, managed, and administrated by our by our certified technicians. So thank you for coming back, you guys. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Have a great day. Bye.